The Show Windows program is a 12 month program of artworks created by artists, architects, designers, makers, creatives that will be taking place in shop windows throughout the city centre and slightly beyond. It's going to be a really exciting program that's based on a book by L. Frank Baum called The Art of Decorating Dry Goods where he wrote about how you can create magical spaces within shop windows to encourage people to look in and then ultimately to want to buy their wares. What's really exciting about that book is L. Frank Baum was also the author of the Wizard of Oz books, the first of which was published the same year as the decorating book and that is where we've sort of taken our inspiration from. He wrote about these windows as show windows, this is where the title comes from, and also the inaugural artwork that we've put in is by a local illustrator called Ben Javins, where he's rethought Coventry skyline as the Emerald City. The Emerald City within the Wizard of Oz books being a place of creativity and magic and colour, and Coventry this year for the City of Culture being exactly that. Every month we're responding to the themes of the City of Culture as well as linking back to that Wizard of Oz, the art of dry goods and this idea of the windows being places to tell stories, to be the beginning point of a journey that we're inviting audiences to go on. The show windows has been an absolute dream project to curate. As a curator, these are the briefs that you want to have because you're able to work with really unique Coventry-based, West Midlands-based talent, as well as Think Nationally, who's out there making really exciting artworks, as well as through the Coventry in the World Month, thinking about those global artists that you can bring into the city. Making that final decision of who those artists are going to be, it's not very easy at all. What approach I've taken is bringing artists in who are very representative of the diverse communities that exist within Coventry, but also those artists that are already thinking about creating environments and sort of places and stories within which audiences can enter through and then go into another world through their work.